This is a penny. That's an awkward Wisconsin kid making videos in his backyard. And these are some of the viral editing tactics that Ryan Trahan uses to generate millions of views on his penny series. Yeah, that's right. But first, the game plan. <clears throat> Okay, first, I'll teach you guys how to edit this awesome head follow effect in DaVinci Resolve. It's going to be great. Second, I will teach you guys how to edit the sound effects that Ryan Trahan uses to stay cheesy. Oh yeah. I like that burrito slap. Third, I will teach you guys how to use the highlighted object effect, like I'm using right now to highlight my head. And number four, I will teach you guys how to use the text effects that Ryan Trahan uses to keep you watching all the way to the end. Let's get started. First, you need to grab an adjustment clip and drag it over the video that you want to animate. Zoom it in and position it so it's on your face, my face, <laughs> all right, whoever's face. Then add keyframes to the X and Y coordinates. This will save the current position and the whatever position we add next, the frame will animate to it. Go through and make keyframes with the sliders and the animation should turn out like this. There are a few sound effects that Ryan adds to his videos that just make things so iconic. The slap, crunch, coin jingle, and drum hit are a few that make Ryan's videos his own. These are pretty straightforward to edit. Just slap them under your footage in appropriate places, or rather inappropriate places to make them funnier, like the crunch. But the thing to remember about sound effects is to keep the quiet sounds the loudest. In other words, a quiet object in real life, such as cloth, should sound exponentially louder in a video. I don't even know what you would call this, but a highlighted object is the best I could come up with. It it works. Basically, Ryan puts these in his videos to show something specific. So that's what we'll make. First, put your playhead over the object that you want to add the highlight to. Jump over here into the Fusion tab, type Shift Space, and add a background node. Turn the alpha down to around 50%. Add an ellipse mask. Plug the ellipse mask into the background node, and that'll mask it out as a circle. Size it up if you need to in the inspector using the height and width. Make sure they're both the same-ish. Check invert, and then add key frames to the position of the mask. Then, just like the follow effect, use the keyframes and move the mask around the object that you want to highlight. Then, in the edit page if you want to, you can add some text. Make sure to use Arial font, and there you go. Speaking of text, this brings us to the final effect. Text. So, this effect was made completely in the edit page. First, type what you want in a regular text clip. Add a dynamic zoom to it, and then checking the overlay to dynamic zoom, adjust it so it's less dramatic. Duplicate the text and then put it on top of the first clip using the alt drag shortcut. Make the top one red. Shorten it, and then make it fade out. Then move both text effects up and add a solid color generator underneath. Drag the opacity down, and there you have it. The game plan. I love saying that. You know, it's creators like Ryan that make me appreciate life as a YouTuber a little bit more. YouTube doesn't have to be exploitative. It can actually change lives. Ryan, if you're watching, thank you for all that you do. Your journey as a creator, we're going to create for restoration, person, and even your faith is inspiring. I'd love to chat. Whenever I started looking at who Jesus was and like even the things he said and like the things he taught, it realized like, wow, this is so loving. Now it is my source of joy. Like it is my source of love. It is my source of everything. Because I have that, I can go into the world and do onto others like what I feel like I already have. Anyways, that's all for this video. Let's not create for an algorithm. Make something redemptive and heartfelt for people. I'll see you guys in the next video.